I think it's safe to assume that almost everyone who has tried ice cream likes it to some extent. However, we all like specific flavors of ice cream, like chocolate and vanilla. But honestly, who likes or would even want to try one of these flavors? Consider this a warning. If you love ice cream so much that you'd say you'd eat a bucket of every flavor in the world, you'd better take that back because here are the top 10 weirdest ice cream flavors. Squid ink isn't exactly new to being put in foods. Some places like putting in spaghetti sauce. But why ice cream? Spaghetti sauce and ice cream are drastically different from each other. And squid mucus doesn't sound like a good addition to either. Interestingly, this jet black ice cream has been described to taste sweet, sour, bland, fishy, and metallic. Which to me sounds like it gets worse and worse. Breast milk ice cream replaces the normal milk in ice cream with human breast milk. It isn't an awful idea due to breast milk being extremely healthy, but that doesn't make it any less weird. Ice cream isn't supposed to be healthy, it's supposed to be a desert. Foie gras ice cream is one of the only ones on this list that doesn't explain what's in it when you hear its name. Foie gras ice cream contains caviar, Mustard and black truffles. Ugh, it sounds like Patrick's favorite ice cream flavor from Spongebob. Dill pickle swirl with mustard and extra bacon bits. Patrick, this is your favorite ice cream. It actually could have been worse. Because foie gras is an actual meal, and it contains duck and goose liver. Lobster and ice cream is one of the last food combos I could think of. Yet someone out there decided it was a good combination. Or at least a testable combination. I mean, someone's bound to like it, right? Right? Oh. Personally, I don't associate hot seafood with icy dessert. Lobsters are normally boiled to death. So, in this case, are they frozen to death? There's a disorder out there known as pica. What pica does is it causes its sufferers to desire to eat non-edible things, such as wood, cotton, rock, coral, mud, dirt, brick, etc. I bet this creator had pica. Have you ever wondered what ash tastes like? Well then here you go, charcoal ice cream. Now you could be one of many who are now walking fireplaces. Kind of like breast milk ice cream, this ice cream flavor doesn't add anything to ice cream, but instead replaces. Crocodile egg ice cream replaces the normal chicken eggs with, you guessed it, crocodile eggs. What gave this person the idea to replace chicken eggs with crocodile eggs? There are other animals that lay eggs as well. However, this is a triple entry, where there are three different types of crocodile egg ice cream flavors. Durian, Pandan, and Dragon Fruit. It is actually the only one on this list that has been claimed to taste good. BAM! Horse meat ice cream. Yeah. Not only does it taste like horse, but it has actual horse meat chunk squares in it. I think it's a better idea to ride the horse and keep it as a pet than kill it, chop it into little cubes, and turn it into what used to be one of my favorite foods. Cow tongue! We've been through a lot of animal flavored ice cream now. Cow, horse, crocodile, but how much was snake? This ice cream was probably made from someone who got lost in the wilderness and had to eat cold mashed snake to survive. Even then, why would it become an ice cream flavor afterwards? Pit vipers are a deadly snake in Japan, so why not use a less deadly snake? Or how about not use a snake at all? That's a smart move. And yet it surprisingly doesn't taste good. Who doesn't like snake?
Finally, we've reached the end, and Eskimo ice cream just beats Pit Viper. Eskimo contains deer, seal, caribou, meese, walrus, and whale. It gets worse. It doesn't contain the blubber from whale, walrus, and seal, but instead oil from their skin fat. That's even worse. It's also known as Alaskan ice cream. It also contains berries. Berries I've never heard of, like cloud berries and salmon berries. They must only grow in Alaska or something. But even then, why? I don't think many people who knew what is in this would eat this. If you have a top 10 idea, put it in the comments below and it could be a future video. I'm sorry if this ruined your appetite. Thanks for watching. Bye.